today I'm going into known tick territory, so uh, this is kind of important. All right, cool. Let's uh, let's head out. So you see me paint here, uh, uh, well, a number of times actually in all seasons, and uh, I was gonna say it's one of my favorite places. But I sort of always say they're all my favorite places, so um, I think it's painting is my favorite thing. So, uh, see this tree here? It's like, and I've thought about painting this tree so many times and uh, stopping here this close to the car just never really seems like the right thing to do. So, um, but one of these days. Maybe I'll plan on doing two and I'll go back in here and paint where I like to and then I'll come back. I'll come back and maybe paint this one on the way out. So, all right, we're going to go down there and around that corner and out to where Hidden Pond is. Come to think of it, I've always taken pictures of the pond, video of the pond. I've been to the pond. But I've never actually painted the pond, and I've been here a lot of times. So today, I'm thinking we'll give that a shot, and I'm hoping that I can get down close enough and actually find uh, a really good view down by the pond. So let's uh, let's go uh, let's go check it out, and hopefully we don't collect any uh, collect any ticks along the way. So all right. I came around the corner and uh, I had no idea that it was this way, but the spider warts, uh, that's the name of this purple flower, the spider warts are out and man, are they, are they beautiful. Um, yeah, I'm so tempted to pick a spot where I can just paint these, uh, these purple flowers in amongst all the green. Um, but, uh, I'm gonna press onto the pond first and see if I can get a good look at that before I uh, am completely overtaken by the beauty of these purple flowers. But man, are they really something. Take a second and uh, just talk just a little bit about my strategy here. Um, this uh, this pond is gonna it's sort of gonna be lower center of the painting. Um, the whole uh, green landscape here is gonna be on the bottom third of the painting, and I'm gonna keep this tree over here on the on the left hand side, um, and I'm gonna add this tree over here on the right hand side. Um, this one right here, which uh, I think is kind of important um, for uh, for because we're sort of looking through a window at this pond, and I'm gonna have to open up just a little bit of that um, kind of those water hyacinths that are down in there, so that I can um, maybe get a little bit of the blue sky reflecting on the water. And I really like the way this uh, background here um, has this really kind of really deep green uh, down in here. And it's like sunlit on this left side, um, very yellowish green hillside um, in the distance there. And then on this side of the pond, we've got uh, a few spider warts here in the front, and we've got you know some darker greens and stuff uh, here in the foreground, which I think will set that off really nice. So um, yeah, so a little purple, darker greens here, definitely yellow green on that hillside, lit up trees on the left side, and that sort of deep dark uh, background 
up in here so yeah so i will uh i'll get a sketch going and um we'll uh yeah we'll paint this cool This is, uh, this is where I'm at uh, at the moment here. And I uh, just wanted to just kind of talk you through where I'm headed next. Obviously this, this distant hill um, is, uh, I'm just gonna test a value just to get a feel for kind of what that actually looks like back there. And I think it's probably a lot closer to this. Um, so, but I can't really I can't really lay this in quite yet until I, uh, yeah, that's going to be much better. I can't really lay that in until I get this distant tree line here and then, then kind of this side trees right here established. And then I can kind of start going over top of that. Got the sky where I like it. So I'm going to be okay there. Um, 
but uh, so now I'll just kind of start working my way forward. So I'll get this tree lines in, then I'll get this ground, and then it'll be this tree, which actually I just painted through this, which um, for those of you who are new to painting, you're, you want to do that as much as you can. Don't like stop here and then start there. Just paint right through it because when you come back, you'll be laying these uh, these things right over top of it. So, um, yeah. Uh, and then uh, do some work down here on maybe on this shadow foreground. And I'll just kind of work my way from these trees right back out of the painting. So, all right, cool. All right, so thanks so much for checking out the video today. I really do appreciate it. Uh, thank you for following along. Thank you for subscribing and for uh, 
commenting. Um, I do enjoy your comments very much, and I want to say thank you for those. So keep those uh, keep those coming. It's great dialogue, even when it's a comment that you hate my music. Um, that's okay. I don't mind. So uh, yeah. So that's gonna wrap it up here. Um, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe before you go. And as always, I will catch you later.